following the success of Love Island, returning in June, ITV are bringing another dating style show to the screen. Bosses are planning a series based on 1989 film Shirley Valentine, in which a 42 year old mum heads abroad and finds love with a Greek local. Unlike Love Island and Survival of the Fittest, which focuses on why 20 somethings. This series will cast famous women aged 40 and over. It will be called My Sh Early Valentine Summer. According to The Sun, and will start filming next month. A source said, whether it is discovering a new relationship, hobby or career or rediscovering their confidence and ambition. The show will see the famous group living together and forming new friendships to share every moment of this unique experience. It's the trip of a lifetime. They added, casting agents are busy choosing celebs to take part at the moment and are focusing on single women at a crossroads in their life who would benefit from the journey. Love Island sends its stars into instant fame but which established celebrities could be set to take part. Loose Women's Colleen Nolan, 53, has been very open about her relationship struggles and announced she'd split from her husband Ray Fence earlier this year. The couple took a break in 2017 and she used her celebrity Big Brother appearance to take some time apart. But she realized how much she missed him, saying, I forgot I had those feelings, so to have those moments again was such a lovely thing. Similarly, Davina McCall, 50, confirmed she and her husband Matthew Robertson had separated late last year. Davina regularly shows off her gym honed body on Instagram. So could she be set to slip into a for a summer of love? Across the pond, Jennifer Aniston, 49 and husband Justin Theroux split in February of this year. The Friends star would be an A-list signing to the show that may seem highly unlikely. But after Desperate Housewives Terry Hatcher, 53, appeared on a celebrity special of The Great British Bake Off, Anything Is Possible. Daily Star Online has contacted a representative for IT.